Hi, this is Daryl Etherington from TechCrunch, and today we're looking at the Tactus Form, a screen protector for your iPad embedded in a case that also produces physical keys on demand when you need them. So what we have here is the ability to go from a normal flat featureless touchscreen mm -hmm. and have it deform, so morph, so rise up and fall. Wow. So what we're doing here is we're all about improving the usability of typing on a QWERTY keyboard. Mm -hmm. And with what we call our finger guides, you just type as normal, but as you're touching the, the, these keys, you're getting this tactile feedback. And what that does is improves your usability by giving you that, that the ability of muscle memory as you type. Yeah, it's just it's a slightly raised area, but it, 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 it has a little bit of give to it when you press it as well, right? That's right, yeah. So we spent a, a, a lot of time looking at the typing and trying to enhance the, the iOS keyboard. Mm -hmm. So this is, works with the standard keyboard on, on the Mini. Uh, you get all the, the features of the standard keyboard, so autocorrect, word prediction, so on. But these finger guides allow you to improve the tactile feedback and bring up uh, and develop muscle memory. So as you get used to typing on this, you type faster. It's a more satisfying experience. So this is this is basically what is going to shift to consumers when you do search. Yeah, absolutely. So so this the, the product here is a uh, it's a case, and we designed this with Ammunition Group here in San Francisco to oh, really get this very. They've got a lot of wins under their belt. Actually. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Very well known for 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 example the Beats Audio. They've they've been doing. So they, we, worked, we partnered with them to come up with a, an industrial design that was very complementary to the Apple styling, mm -hmm. uh, very thin and, and, and lightweight. Yeah, it doesn't but add much uh, additional width or depth. Or that, that's right. And then importantly, the way you activate this is using the slider on the back. So rather than having to have another accessory you have to keep charged, this is always available. Mm -hmm. And wherever your hands are, where you want to type, you're able to just turn on the keyboard that way. How much testing went into figuring out that that, that is the right size? Uh, quite a bit, actually. <laughs> we, we've spent a lot of time with the, the usability guys, both at Tactus and at uh, Ammunition, to understand what was the right size, shape, feel to have this in the, the right position. Cool. And then what's next after this for you guys? So we're looking at, another, another, this, this is the first of a family of products. So we're going to start with a uh, with, with the Mini, then iPhone 6 Plus, and then after that, looking at the iPo, iPo, uh, iPad Air, as well as the, the iPhone 6. Is it, a, is it a bigger challenge to do it with smaller devices or? The, the, the technology itself can be scaled down really to any size, but we could put it on, on wearables if needs be. Mm -hmm. uh, what, what, what we're focused on is making sure we can deliver the same usability benefits really regardless of, of the screen size. So what works here, these finger guides, these crescents on top of the buttons, works well for the screen size. As you get smaller, we'll adjust the shape really to give you the best possible typing experience on those smaller screens. Equally, when we go large and we go to the iPad Air, we're going to, we will be looking at 10-finger typing. So that's, again, a very different typing mode for, for, from this device. Great. So a, a case is, like, is, is lovely the way that you've designed it here, but what about putting it right in the device so that you don't... Yeah, absolutely. So, this, so form, we start with form in terms of first product so we can really address today's installed base of devices and, and deliver that better usability. To give you an example where, where we're headed next, this is a, an engineering uh, sample that we've developed with our manufacturing partner, Wistron. And what we've done here is we've taken an existing shipping tablet and we have replaced the cover glass with our, the Tactus panel and then we've done all the integration. So any application that recalls a keyboard automatically turns on the Tactus layer. And so this is now just part of the device, it's mm. seamless. Uh, so whenever you go in and out of an app, the, the, the Tactus guides turn on and off. And we've been able to do this without changing the form factor. So it's the same dimensions as the original tablet. And importantly, actually, it's lighter. It's 15 grams lighter than the original tablet, wow. uh, where we had glass in the front. So this is where it's headed. So next year, you'll start seeing the first integrated products. But today, you can get access to the Tactus solution in form uh, through, these, through these accessories, starting with the iPad Mini. Great. So you've saved, you've saved weight there. But what about um, component cost? And then what else about durability versus glass? Yeah, so first of all, on the cost, uh, this is a very cost competitive with the glass-based solution. Glass requires actually quite a lot of, of, of handling and processing because it's very delicate. Mm -hmm. Our panel solution is actually a very high volume capable sort of layer, layer process that goes together to make it. So it's, it's very cost competitive with, with the glass solution. In terms of the, uh, the durability, we've spent a tremendous amount of time looking at the durability of this. Uh, it's shatterproof, so that's one immediate improvement over glass. Mm -hmm. And it's also got great scratch performance. It's, it's very bendable, very resistant to breaking. And we've done on form 
uh, extensive usability tests, drop tests, scratch tests, high low temperature tests to really to, to ensure that it meets the requirements of the market and we can continue to do that as we push from the accessory products into the integrated products. Great. The Tactus form for iPad Mini launches on February 12th, 2015 in pre-order and it will retail for $149. They plan to ship the first batch beginning in summer 2015.